drop it on a crafting table, we get nine ingots out of it. Or we get nine whatevers out of it. Use it later. Use it later. Oh, good. Guess I'll use it later. Knife, we need silicone, rubber, and titanium. Hold on. Don't cook these yet. There's, there's no point. What do we have? Peeper. Actually, there is a point. Jeepers, creepers. Where'd you get them peepers? I don't know if we should make uh, glass yet. Hold on, I'm getting my sea legs here. Cooked peeper, consume. Thank you so much, we're feeling great. So, we want titanium. We want titanium. That's mission number one. Let's get two missions here. I think we can handle two missions simultaneously. We want titanium. And we want whatever we need to make the repair kit. The repair, repair tool, I should say. Cave sulfur, titanium, and silicone rubber. So more titanium. And then also creep vine cluster so that we can make silicone rubber. All right. See you later, boys. Yo ho 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 ho. Oh. I know that it's programmed to give you those creatures some sort every time that you drop down. So for now, we're just doing some exploration. I don't like these guys. They got acid associated with them. These appear to be creepy vines. Can I get a ha ha every time that shows up in every time those guys show up, please? This might sound a little Canadian of me. I don't know if maybe we should leave some creep vine so that it can continue to grow. Acquired. Target acquired. There we go. Hoverfish. Oh! Life on this planet grows in unusually Hello, Tomo. and diverse ecological biomes. Further study recommended. The you got salvage attached to your head. Hold on a minute. Hoverfish. Small, edible prey fish. Live your life. You're too cute to die. is this another egg so we're still looking for ooh for some titanium ah! <laughs> I think when I take this titanium he's going to be real pissed Run. Run. Don't look. Oh, that made me feel weird. <laughs> oh, okay. We made it, though. Yo. Why are you so large? That alien egg is freaking huge, dude. No, I don't wish to make lubricant. I do wish to make some silicone rubber. Some silicone rubber. Two is probably fine for now. Also get some titanium. Deployables. A waterproof locker. Okay, I understand. Next step. We want our battery. Which is still in our inventory. Hold on. So we can make a... I think... I know I said we needed a knife. Um, I Repair tool requires glass. Okay, so we'll start with the repair tool. I've been told that's priority number one. 
In order to make the repair tool, you need quartz to make glass. Start with glass. That was indeed the flashlight. We need cave solver. I was a fool. Do I have any... Did I use my cave sulfur? No. Personal. Equipment. Personal. Tools. Repair tool. Oh! Baby! Now I got a radio too. This is an alarm. The stress signal is on. The rescue operation will be dispatched to your location in nine, 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 nine hours. Continue to monitor for emergency transmissions from other life pods. Nine hours. That's ridiculous. The game's 26 hours long. Okay, use fabricator. Next step. Give me a scanner. Scanner? The scanner can be used to synthesize blueprints from salvage technology and to accord alien biological data. Scan everything? Got it. Next step. Give me a knife. Weapons were removed from standard survival blueprints following the massacre on Abraxas Prime. The knife remains the only exception. The one in front of the knife lives forever. We will need some food soon. Um, make some fins as well. Swim speed gets increased by 15%. The fabricator draws from available data to provide environment appropriate equipment using locally available Yo, materials. let's go. For your safety, this setting cannot be overridden. We need food and we are going to scan everything. Self scan. Self scan complete. Okay. Vital signs normal. Continuing to monitor. Ah! It's night time again. I imagine that's gonna happen. I'm not really trying to get to a hundred percent. So if I'm scanning too much, please feel free to let me know. Just scan technology. Sorry, I just scratched my hand there. Please. That's my salvage man. Banger alert, absolutely true. Okay, we, we need you. I'm, no, we don't need you, you're free. What we do need, peepers for food. Bladder fish for water. Peepers for food. I'm assuming maybe we can scan them in the inventory once we get them. Oh, 
No, you cannot. <laughs> of course. How could I be so foolish? Hello! Oh, it's a uh, the kamikaze fish. Yo. It's actually extremely painful. This seems like a good idea. Run! <laughs> Alright, we need to eat and we need to drink some water. No, we don't need to drink any water. What are you talking We need to eat some food. We also need to heal. How does one. I guess we need to use our medical kits. Cured food. So we need salt deposits for cured food, which I'm assuming goes bad less quickly. There's a thing that makes med kits called a medical fabricator. Cured food doesn't go bad, but it does dehydrate you. You know what? That's great wisdom. Thank you so much. Yo, this thing's flipping full, man. Food plus 32. Well, we're over eating, but that's a good sign. Is it just endlessly make med kits? Ah, I see. Still nighttime, huh? Well, onwards and upwards. Now you should visit the Aurora. I'm here to let you know that I don't know what that means. Make a flashlight? That's a very sensible idea. Uh, did you hear that? <laughs> so I'm guessing based on the fact that your name's Stalker. Oh, the Aurora is the big ship, that's right. That you're not gonna stop following me. Caution. Continued degradation of the Aurora's drive core may result in a quantum detonation. Continuing to monitor. Qu -qu -qu quantum detonation? Oh, jeez. Okay. Mm Feel like anytime we see. Metal, that's where we want to be. Bring out your scanner. But for what purpose? Sea glass. Oh! Now we can learn how to make a sea glider. I understand. 30 seconds. You need one more. I think that's not the first piece we found, but I've completely forgotten where the first piece we found actually was. They're all over the place. Even better. That's great news. It's almost like this is a very good game. Well designed. Gotcha. It has like 98 positive reviews on Steam. It is very important, however, to save your game. It does not auto-save. Probably shouldn't get close to that, huh? So many people, like someone just said, you should go back and get that box. And give it to Ruka. Ruka's box is fixed. I fixed it. 
You don't have to worry about my son. I take care of my own. Sorry, did I say 98 positive reviews? I meant 98% positive. Well, thinking for now, let's go back. How's the bitrate, by the way? I, I'm assuming it could look a little clearer. Because of the fact that it's just a... Uh, I mean, it's a pretty dense game to begin with. Inventory full. You know what? Fair enough. I forgot these things are flipping huge. Well, let's go deposit then. You know, I don't really want to drop anything. We'll come back later. Hoop fish. Well, I can't grab it anyway. All right, let's go back. Let's go back. We can always make a... Uh, like a uh, flotation chest. There's also a new radio message. Fantastic. See, this is the perfect... I guess that's what the icon on the right means. Um, it's a good uh, mix of backseating because it's helping me actually get through this. So let's see what you got going on. I appreciate it. This is LifePod 3 uploading our coordinates. We're plugging some holes in our emergency sea glide. So if we're late for the rendezvous, don't panic. Also, don't go home without us. Seriously. Three out. Signal right. location uploaded to PDA. I'm actually like, how do I put this stuff in here? <laughs> At this point. Um, you know, here you go. Take the fire extinguisher. Can't fit. Make a lot of... Lo oh, you know what? You're a genius. We can at least... Condense, uh... We can turn... Actually, you know what? Give me a little silicone rubber. We'll alternate for now. Lubricant is essential in construction of vehicles and power plants. I know. I'm an engineer, too. Lube is useless right now. Yeah, but if it takes up less space, I don't know. Seems somewhat sensible to me. We can definitely also, like, I hate to do this, but we probably don't need this many acid mushrooms. I don't know if that's a classic strategy, but that's what we're going to do. You can make more batteries as well. Use your acid mushrooms to get batteries. <laughs> well, no, 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 no. Okay, there, acid mushrooms are everywhere. We don't need to worry. You don't have copper, though? Uh, don't I, though? So check this out. First things first. Give me four titaniums. Please make me a waterproof locker. Well, it's close enough. I really thought it would float at the surface. That's okay. What, do, what should we put in here? We should be smart, okay? So I'm thinking in here... I think I just ate that nutrient block like, a, like an idiot. Um, let's put rubber and lubricant in there.
That's the that's the chest for weekends. Rubber and lubricant. Well, here's the thing. You're like, well, why would you do that? So that you always have to go outside if you want to craft? Well, it was either that or I was thinking we could put food and water in there. But that didn't seem like a very smart idea either. You know, based on the fact that... We make that stuff in the fabricator. So, I don't care about boomerangs. I would like some more bladder fish. But I also want to get some sediment. So, food is also important, please. We need just a little, I think. Bladder fish. A couple of these will keep us going for a little while. For now. Thank you for the lion Kratos, please. Much appreciated. Stab corals? Yo, I never would have thought about that. Although, now that I'm thinking about it, I'm like, maybe... <laughs> Are you trolling? Maybe no trolling? Do it to tubes as well. Okay. Thank you. Good to know. End creep vines? One of these days is gonna be a troll, dude, I can tell. Mobile. <laughs> Mobile vehicle bay. Oh, cut creeper with knife. Can I get capital SSS, lowercase SSS in chat, please? Thank you. Thank you. Inventory full. That was fast. What's so big? Everything. Okay, good to know. You can also eat vines for water. Yo. Had to know. It will work. Have you ever been underwater? Um, yes. On myriad occasions. Bathing, for example, is a big one. Fiber mesh. Strong natural fiber. Comfy. Have you ever scuba? Absolutely not. Never. Pathfinder tool. Displays holographic pathfinder discs used to map a way back out of caves or hard to navigate spaces. Well, first off, give me some titanium. Have you ever boiled water? I'll have you know. I know how to cook. I will be the streamer that advocates for, like, learning how to actually cook. I'm not the only one, nor am I the best. I'm just saying. I'm also figuring, you know, for now, let's put a buttload of titanium in here. Vegan chili doesn't count. Why wouldn't that count? If anything, if you can make vegetarian food, it should count for, like, double. Because you don't have to rely on the goodness of, uh, you know, meat's natural uh, mouthfeel in order to get something to work. Okay. Put some water in here. Writhing weed seed. We gotta craft something. Our inventory is getting way too full. So we can make another waterproof locker, which honestly I do think is actually important, and make a flashlight after that. Noted. 
So I'm, I don't want to make too many of these. As I was told. But for now, for organizational purposes, this seems advisable. And here's what I'm going to do. Open storage. Grab all the titanium. Can you change the name of them as well? Seeds will be useless for a long time. Um, unless you eat them as a pastime activity. Please stop laughing at me. You strange whale. I'm trying. Congratulations, survivor. You have exceeded your weekly exercise quotient by 500%. Data indicates that swimming was your favorite activity. Be sure to vary your routine for uniform muscle development. So, now, we would like a flashlight. Making a flashlight requires a battery and glass. We already have glass. To make a battery, we need two acid mushrooms and copper ore. We have no copper ore right now. Um, but we can easily get two acid mushrooms. 